everybody on the uh, forums has been talking about bodies on the different red cats. Um, actually, this is off a of slash. Um, my tracks a slash. Um, actually, just for fun, I was seeing if it fit on the backdraft, which is basically they're all the same. They're earthquake, aftershock, and backdraft, same chassis. So you could fit a uh, aftershock body. I mean, or a, a tracks a slash body on a um, aftershock. Or I could even make this backdraft into a into a short course truck if I wanted to. Um, but this was really to talk about the backdraft bodies. They're pretty narrow, and uh, you know they're kind of they're kind of a pain sometimes to get on. Kind of a tight fit. So uh, I went to my local hobby shop and um, just picked it up because it was cheap enough. But a HPI Vorza buggy body, 21 bucks. Okay, and I trimmed it out and. Uh, Looks looks really good. Haven't painted it yet, but uh, looks really good. A little bit wider, but I think it actually makes the buggy look look, look a lot better. Um, has a little front nose piece. I'd probably like to get a couple more, but uh, for 21 bucks, it came with the masking for the windows. Yeah, a lot of a lot of decals which I doubt I'll use everything because this is a Red Cat, not a Vorza, but um, I might. Everybody will think it's an HPI maybe, I don't know. But um, anyway, 21 bucks, and it fits, and it looks good, and I think it's, uh, you know, it's going to take some more abuse, and um, yeah, I, it's actually, it seems like it's a little bit lighter, even though this has paint and tape on it, but, um, you know, so we'll uh, get it painted up, and we'll see what that looks like.